I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you a very interesting question on radicals. The question is, write the next three terms in the following sequence. Find the tenth term. So we are given first three terms which are square root of 2, square root of 8 and square root of 18. So you have to write the next three terms, right? Three terms. So that will give us 6 and then you define the tenth term. You can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestion. Now here we are given square root 2, square root 8, square root of 18. So let us see how to write square root of 8. Well square root of 8 is equals to square root of 2 times 4 which could be written as 2 square root 2. Correct? Square root of 18 can be written as 2 times 9 and that is 3 square root 2. So we can rewrite this sequence as square root of 2. Instead of 8 we could write this as 2 square root 2. Instead of 18 we could write this as 3 square root 2 right so the next three terms should be so this is like 1 times square root 2 2 times square root 2 3 times square root 2 so the fourth term is 4 square root 2 fifth one is 5 square root 2 sixth one is 6 square root 2 and in that case tenth will be 10 square root 2 right now it is very important to write this in the form which is given to us, right? Therefore, I will rewrite the sequence as square root 2 and that 2 goes inside to make it 4 times 2 is 8. 3 squared is 9, 9 times 2 is 18, right? And 4 squared is 16 and twice 16 is 32. 5 square is 25 times 2 is 50. 6 square is 36 times 2 is 72, right? And the tenth term will be 10 square is 100 times 2 is 200. Is it okay? So that becomes the tenth term. So that is how you can actually complete this sequence. Amanil Kumar. And I hope you find it very interesting. Thank you and all the best.